Hello guys, in today's video we will see the control pollination in Tinda crop. Let's see the step by steps. Firstly, we will first let's understand how to identify the flowers. Tinda is a monoecious flower. This is the male flower. It has only stamen and this is the female flower. Small around immature Tinda fruit is there at in base. This flower we will use for pollination. Now we will select the female bud that will open in next morning and we will bag it by using the butter paper bag to prevent any unwanted cross pollination from insect like bees or wind. On the next morning when flower is ready to open we gently remove the bag. Let's see video. We gently remove the bag and we will take the fresh male flower, remove its petals and expose the anther. We are removing the bag from the female flower. Petals we are removing here. Now we will using the female fully open flower, petals are removing. Now gently applying the pollen from the male flower on the stigma of the female flower. This complete this process is called as pollination. Now we will fix bag tag on it. In tag we will write the female male date of crossing and plant number. Once pollination is completed, we again cover the female flower with the bag to ensure that no contamination occurs during the next 24 to 48 hours. This is our control pollination done in Tinda crops. If you found this video helpful, please share, subscribe our channel, stay connected for more videos on the agricultural, hybrid breeding and crop improvements. Thank you.